Hi, I'm Stuart and welcome to Sarnet Television. We've got young Chris on the other side of the studio and he's going to be giving us an overview of a product available here on Sarnet. It's available from SoundOff and it is the Enforce interior light bar, but it's for the passenger side of the vehicle. So from here, take it away, Chris. Thank you, Stuart, and thank you for joining us here at Sirenet Television. With me, a wonderful interior light bar from Sound Off Signal. It's the ENF WBFP. It's an interior light bar that's part of the Enforce family, and this version is a one piece that's designed for passenger side mounting on your vehicle. Included with the one piece passenger half Enforce interior light bar is a wonderful set of aluminum black powder coat finished mounting brackets. These are included along with this and depending on the vehicle that you're working with, take a look at our drop down menu that will offer you vehicle specific brackets as well as a universal bracket set. So if you're not working with a vehicle that's in the top four, top five for law enforcement special service packages, the universal install kit will work wonderful for you. Also to fashion the brackets, onto the Enforce interior bar and in turn fashion this onto the vehicle's headliner, there is a nice packet of hardware, nuts and bolts included. The Enforce bar itself is put together with a total of four modules. It's in a nice self-contained shroud and with that black powder coat finish and it's actually an aluminum extrusion. Included is a set of rubber gaskets that actually go onto the edge, as you can see here on the front curve and on the side profile that would be next to the rear view mirror. And what this will do is allow this to mount up nice and flush with the front windscreen and it allow it not to have any chattering against the glass. So really nice there. It'll also have a perfect snug fit to the glass, reducing any flashback that you would have from the brightness of the Enforce modules here. It's available in different color configurations, so depending on what you're looking for, white, ambers, reds, and blues, you can go ahead and set this up to your preference. For wiring up the interior bar, it includes a nice lengthy heavy-duty three-wire harness. And for this fixture, there is a wonderful detailed installation guide from SoundOff that's included. So this will go over the features of the bar, the wiring of the bar, and details for mounting it up on the passenger side headliner using the sun visor bracket points. A unique feature is a breakout control box. So this is included along with the interior bar. This breakout box here will allow you to take the three wire harness connect that harness to a wire pigtail system. Again, that's included with that. And from there, wiring this in conjunction with the breakout box will allow you to have a set of pigtail control wires to tie into your vehicle siren and lighting control system. So for a demonstration here, we'll take the breakout box and take the wiring harness, plugging it into the side port here. It corresponds in with one specific direction, so you don't have to worry about any flip-flopping of the wires and the colors that they correspond to. So we'll snap this into place here. And on the breakout box, there's two holes that go through the plastic housing. That will allow you to mount the breakout box in a position of your choosing. So in a system where you have a center console or on a rear electronics tray with the rest of your electronic equipment. A series of pigtail wires will be connected to both ground, power, and to push buttons on your control system. Again, they're specified in the wonderful detail sheet that comes along with the Enforce bar. I'll go ahead now, put connections to the pigtails here to give you an example of how this will work for you. We'll take a set of clips, ground, lead, and connect them onto the pigtails here. So the Enforce bar itself and the breakout box both need to be supplied with power. So you'll have a trigger wire running from the harness on the Enforce bar and running from the breakout box as well. Connect those to power here, turn on the unit, and with that you are now ready to activate the warning mode or the takedown function. So we'll take a set of trigger wires here, color corresponding to the install sheet again to match up with the function that you need. So taking the set of four wires here, each one controlling one of the modules, applying those to power will activate the warning function. So as you can see, nice and bright, we have a version put together here that's configured with white, blue, and red. 
The Enforce bar does allow you to go through and make adjustments to the flash pattern. So with that, when you're doing your initial install, you can go through and pick pattern displays that are appropriate for your configuration. So as you can see, a wonderfully put together passenger side interior light bar from our friends at Sound Off Signal. Included is mounting hardware, again, vehicle specific and universal a breakout box to tie the wiring in and let you tie this in to your siren and lighting control system. I'm Chris, thanks for joining me here on SirenNet. Back to you, Stuart. Thanks, Chris. Always nice to know how the Enforce interior passenger side light bar works. And a great overview from Chris. Thanks, Emil. You've been watching SirenNet Television. I'm Stuart, and thanks for watching.